Portland school leaders asking the public to keep the cash coming to help pay for teachers. The board voted to put a school levy renewal on the ballot this May that would help 600 teachers in the classrooms. Board members also voted to sell off the headquarters building to a nonprofit buyer. Lisa Balick is digging deeper into this live now in North Portland and looking at what they're wanting to do in the future. Lisa? Yeah, and really the key here is in the future. Nothing is happening right away whatsoever. The plan is to tear down eventually the school building, use the 10-acre property to revitalize the neighborhood, put in affordable housing and community services. All in favor, please indicate by saying yes. 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 At the board meeting last night, the school leaders approved a resolution that they intend to sell the Portland School Headquarters property to a nonprofit. Albina Vision Trust for redevelopment to build affordable housing and community space in the historically black neighborhood. In return, Vision Trust will help the district buy a new property for its headquarters to be determined, but likely in downtown Portland. To do that, the, the resolution directs the superintendent designee to establish a timeline, create a work plan, an operating agreement, and establish a criteria with um, AB, Albina Vision Trust. There's no timeline yet for when this would happen, not even a place identified for where the Portland School headquarters would move to. Dozens of possible buildings, mostly in downtown Portland. There are concerns, though, as to what would happen to other operations at the central office, like fleet operations, warehouse supply, nutrition services. And the plan has some critics, some who say the school board should offer up the property to other possible buyers. They don't have to sell. They don't have to do this. They can wait. They've waited for years. They've been talking about it. They should make this an open, competitive process because it's a valuable public asset. But Albina Vision Trust says acquiring the property will help them create a thousand housing units and bring thousands of families back into the historic area. A move they say will ensure working class and historically disenfranchised communities have a home in the heart of Portland. Again, they're taking baby steps in that direction. But as for renewing the levy, that for sure will be on the May ballot. Live in North Portland, Lisa Balick, Coin 6 News. Okay, we'll have to see what happens in May. But in the future, what happens with that property behind you, Lisa? Thank you.